to see you. In person. Yeah, I'm so person. thrilled that you're here. Thanks for being here. Now, you both, you actually have a lot in common. You both went to the same high school in New York, yes, LaGuardia, right. which is, you know, very famously known as, as the fame school. Yes. Adrian, you studied drama. What do you remember about your time there? Um, it was great. It was a wonderful uh, escape uh, from Queens. <laughs> <laughs> I, I used to have to take four trains to go to the city. Uh, LaGuardia is near Lincoln Center, and there was no direct way from where I grew up. So I used to have to go through, like... I always felt bad for the Queens yeah. and Staten Island. Yeah, every, every bad neighborhood you could go through, my train would go through in right. about an hour each way. And, uh, you do a two-hour round trip every day? Yep. But that's wow. how passionate we were about our craft. That's how dangerous my local <laughs> high school was. Yeah. Really, basically. <laughs> Would, were you aware when you were there that... Do they talk to you about previous two? Would they say, oh, you know, well, Adrian Brody... Yeah, I mean, there's kind of like a shrine of... Is of there? Adrian Brody's, Adrian Grenier. Uh huh. Um, Shrine of Adrian's. Khalees yeah. and. Khalees? Yes. I didn't know Khalees went there. She did. I had a teacher tell me she was like, she was a drama major, but they were like, she was a hallway major. She wasn't in class. Oh, yeah. Oh, because she wasn't in class. <laughs> but I don't know. So. Yeah. Um, but yeah, they're, they're definitely very proud of. Oh, that's you know, nice. But was there ever, that. did people ever just, was it like the show? Do people ever break out into Dancing songs and just dance tables around tables? No. Yeah. No. Oh, that's no. so disappointing. It is, wasn't it? That's it was so annoying. Me too. It was yeah. Like, yeah. It was public school. Yeah, it's it wasn't public that, high like, school. Yeah. But know, there was no one like. No Hollywood. one even broke out into songs. Hollywood, no. No. Oh, that's really. Well, there yeah. was an old. There, it, it changed. So the the old school, which was performing arts, may have done that. I yeah. can, I can't vouch for that, but that right. was. Right. Pacino went there. Well, he's a he big got song expelled. And dance yeah. man. He got expelled. Why? He got expelled. What he did he get expelled he for? He didn't dance on the tables. Is that yeah. why? <laughs> See? No, I don't know why. Yeah, they <laughs> used to kick you out if you like lost your passion. Um, then you were yeah, no longer. If you longer weren't at an eleven, yeah, then they, you, you were, out. were not. But I then... thought I was going to get kicked off the show before I started. See, that's he wasn't really <laughs> this is why. This is why you're I both. Really was but this is why you're both so cool now because your entire time at school it was like. Be more passionate! <laughs> and then you come out, you're like, oh, my passion's done. This is what I was passionate about. <laughs> yeah, this is it. <laughs> this is it. Now, the holidays are coming up. Um, Adrian, where will, you be, where will you be spending Thanksgiving? New York? <laughs> yeah? Straight back there? Yeah. Absolutely. Hey. What's, what's, the typical, what's the typical Thanksgiving? What will you be doing this year? I just go home, uh, you know, Christmas and Thanksgiving are family times. I'm always home. Um, Almost always. Are they still in Queens? Yeah, my folks still in Queens. Didn't you once insist that everyone in your house yeah. went vegan? <laughs> <laughs> I do. Oh, my, my reputation precedes me. Um, yeah, I, I had a moment where I tried to be vegan, and um, you know, I felt bad about all the turkeys that we consume, and I, yeah. you know, and I, and I, I kind of feel bad, but you know, I, I still eat turkey. And, but one but year, I, one year, I made my parents make a, a vegan turkey, and and it wasn't a hit, and. It was one year, but <laughs> it didn't that, go down that's well. That's not the best part of the meal, though, anyway, no. in my opinion. Well, you like to cook. I do. I love to cook. But yeah. don't you have a, a particular type of cooking video oh. that you like to watch? Yes, I, I'm really into ASMR things. So ASMR <laughs> is just the sounds. Yeah, it's like odd, it's like, auto okay. sensory. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, but then there's like all these different like niches. Of things, so like I like cooking stuff like cracking an egg on a bowl, and, like the sound of the whisk. But you like, mean just listening to thing. it? Just listening. I mean, I watch a video. I'm she not gonna really like recipe. cracking eggs on a bowl. She's like, I just like to watch it. Yeah, <laughs> listen like to it. Oh yeah, that's the ASMR experience. So when do you listen to this to go to sleep? Yeah, I, I go to sleep with it. I introduced my dad to ASMR videos, and he likes voice stuff, like when they're like soft. And then I also like soap cutting. I mean, this is that's a whole. Good. Thing. Yeah, it's good. It's soap good. cutting. Um, yeah, you know, check it out. Soap cutting. I've tried these sort of ASMR things. I don't think it's for me. Okay. I, I get a little ASMR meditation. There. Yeah, yeah. I, but I just get because they just. They, uh, it starts to well, what are you panic watching? me out. Like, I can't do, like, mukbang stuff where people are just eating. I don't even know what that is. That's when people are just eating. I guess I'm, like, the ASMR expert. So this is people who are like, crunching things. Yeah, yeah. No, see, that, does, that would yeah, just make that, me hungry. The prospect of watching someone it's like a Dorito fry commercial. an egg, yeah. <laughs> watching somebody fry an egg and then go to sleep, for me, is like, if I'm watching that, I'm like... 
All right, I guess I'm frying an egg. <laughs> that's like, that's, where, that's, that's what it would do for me. me. Um, now, Adrian, I got it. Well, let's talk about Succession yeah. because I love the show so much. And I really, really loved your episode. It Thank felt you. so familiar. The character was incredible. Talk to me about stepping onto that set. Did it ever feel... Did it feel intimidating going into something that's already such a success? Uh, it was very exciting. Is what it yeah. was really exciting. I'm, I'm such a fan of the show, and the writing, as you know, is just so impeccable, and the acting is great, and I, you know, I'm, Brian Cox is an amazing actor, mm. and Jeremy was so good to me and so strong in it. And, you know, it's, uh, it's, it's a blessing, you know? It's like what I've been yearning to do for a really long time is to find, you know, to, to, to have, to be a part of things that are bigger and complete and, and that lift me up and they give me an opportunity to really do my thing and they have the infrastructure and the creative uh, collaboration and spirit and then it's just such a wonderful thing to be a part of so I'm, I'm so grateful for it honestly you were so brilliant the, your your look do you come back later in this in the series not allowed to speak about these things <laughs> well it's a hundred percent yes <laughs> there's, there's, that's it um, no, there's not a doubt in my not mind. necessarily but, yeah, but, <laughs> but a little maybe <laughs> <laughs> oh dear <laughs> It was such a good episode, and I can't Thank wait to see much. him come back in the series.